welcome back So today, iba naman ang gagawin natin um, Tayo ay mag-volunteer Nandito tayo sa food bank Para tumulong uh, mag-repack ng mga foods So I'm here with Chris, the volunteer coordinator And she'll tell us what is food bank And how does food bank work Okay? Yeah, awesome so I'm Chris, the aforementioned Chris. Um, so basically at Food Bank, we operate primarily as a food distribution network. And what that means is that we'll take all this big bulk produce and product, and then we'll distribute that out to our smaller partner agencies. And that's just gonna be places like food pantries, um, smaller food banks, soup kitchens, religious organizations, uh, but basically anywhere somebody who's in need of emergency food assistance will go to. Okay. Okay, and how do you volunteer for a food bank? So to volunteer at the food bank, we make it really easy. Basically, just go to our website and you can just sign right up. So you just put in a few personal information just to make sure that you can sign our waiver um, and that we have all that safety information in case something were to happen in the facility. But you can just sign up um, and we have two shifts running five days a week, Tuesday through Saturday. So it's a very simple process. All right. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Chris. Yeah, no problem. All right. And then the last place that we typically get our um, product from is going to be food drives, which is just people who donate food to us uh, individually. We typically get our produce and our product from three main sources. So number one, our produce is always going to be something local, uh, especially when it comes to sweet potatoes, because North Carolina is the number one leading producer of sweet potatoes in the nation, so we can always rely on our local farmers to get some good, fresh sweet potatoes. So we end up sorting those a lot. Um, and typically that just looks like whatever's in season at the time that we can get in bulk. So sweet potatoes, of course, are pretty much always in season. Um, we've been doing some white potatoes today, had some turnip greens not too long ago. Um, and then during the summer we had some squash and some cucumbers and things like that. Um, but that's pretty much just what we'll get from our local farmers here in North Carolina. Now for um, some other product, we'll typically get that, that from our retail donors, and that's gonna be places like Food Lion, Harris Teeter, a lot of your big name grocery stores that are in the area. And how do you volunteer for a food bank? So to volunteer at the food bank, we make it really easy. Basically just go to our website and you can just sign right up. So you just put in a few personal information just to make sure that you can sign our waiver. Um, and that we have all that safety information in case something were to happen in the facility. But you can just sign up, um, and we have two shifts running five days a week, Tuesday through Saturday. So, very simple process. All right. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Chris. Yeah, no problem. Hi. So today, um, ang gagawin pala natin is to pack um, potatoes like this one. And then <laughs> and then we'll pack them like this. Three hours of packing potatoes, we managed to do about 30 to 40 bags ready for distribution. Mm -hmm. 